Uh, what we have, we got an actual commercial applause. It's an actual warming table. The actual switch to turn it on and off, they actually went bad here. They actually burned out. So what I've done, I actually got us a new switch. We're gonna put it in, very simple. Um, right here, we're just gonna stick the switch back into the holder, right here. And what we're gonna do, it comes and it actually just pops right back in here. And the way I was able to tell if the switch was bad, um, like, like you know, if you're gonna test the switch, you put your meter on continuity, you should get continuity. So if I come here, and this right here is the common for this side. If I put the switch here and I turn it on, I get, I get a tone here. But if I come here and turn it on, I'm not getting a tone. So that let me know that this, this switch right here is bad. If I come right here and put it on this switch, the new one, and I turn it on, I'm good. And then if I come right here, I'm good. So that's the problem that we had. The switch was actually bad. I'm just gonna come here, put my wires back the way we had them. And this right here, it actually runs off of 120 volts. It doesn't run off of 240. And what they're doing, they're actually switching the uh, L1 and the neutral. So they're switching L1 and the neutral here. And what we're gonna do here now, is just plug it up. working now I can turn it off I can turn it on everything works fine all the switches work it's heating up I can smell the heat that's it this uh, unit right here cost about uh, a little more than $1,200 this repair is about a $14 switch uh, we'll bill out for about $200 and uh, this easy way to make a, a quick money Once again, if you want to learn how to start your own appliance repair business go to www.appliancebootcamp.com sign up for our course We'll show you how to make hundred thousand dollars starting your own appliance repair business. Thank you